This here is a multi-purpose hand pump that can be used in many situations. Draining water out of a boat, washing machine, a sink, a toilet, a fish tank, a hot tub. It's pretty much unlimited. Anything that you need to remove fluid out of. The pump and hose are one and a half inches in diameter. The hose is six and a half feet long. The pump is all plastic with a little bit of rubber and these are just the check valves that are on it. Four pumps of the handle will expel one gallon of water. Do not remove the cap at the bottom to use the pump. It will not function without it. The cap is only removed for cleaning or if you get clogs inside the uh, check valve. It's not a continuous siphon pump. It will not continue to flow after a few pumps. You have to continuously pump in order to get water extracted with this pump. Just for some awareness, the first pull of the handle will only fill the pump body. No water will come out of the hose. Pushing the handle down forces water through the inlet at the end of the handle into the body of the pump past the plunger. The next pull of the handle forces water out of the hose while also pulling more water into the pump body. This is a very simple pump, but I will explain some of the pros and cons of it. The overall pump length is 68 inches and that's with the handle fully extended. With the handle fully pushed in, the pump is 36 inches from the bottom of the pump to the top of the handle. As far as pros go, this is a good emergency pump. I wouldn't say that it's a good uh, pump that you would use every day if you needed to. There are definitely more expensive pumps out there. It is easy to store. It works great under perfect conditions. As long as you have a slow and steady pump, no debris in the water, the hose is not elevated above the pump, and nothing is broken or leaking on the pump. That's what would make perfect conditions for use of this pump. You will definitely get a workout if you have a lot of water to pump. You can use cheesecloth and a rubber band on the bottom of the pump to avoid clogging the pump with debris. It'll definitely make the pump last a lot longer and avoid having issues with it constantly clogging as you're using it. And this would mainly apply in water that's got a lot of debris in it. As far as cons go, if you have water with debris in it, it'll clog it up, prevent it from functioning properly. But you can avoid that by using cheesecloth over the bottom of it. It is not a continuous siphon pump. You will have to pump the entire time. I don't recommend using for large amounts of water unless you want a really good workout. The pump can be operated by one person but it can be very difficult depending on the situation. The pump only pulls water up into the pump from the bottom, so the pump has to be held down with one hand while the other hand pumps the handle. The issue becomes the hose. The hose becomes very heavy as water is being pumped out, so you have to have a third hand or a second person to hold the hose wherever you are draining the pump into. I've seen this same or a very similar pump and they run about 33 to 40 dollars which seems to be a little steep for plastic pump it may not be an issue with all the pumps but i had an issue with the pump leaking profusely where the hose connects at the top of the pump the hose is reverse thread no matter how tight i got it it still leaked pretty bad i will venture to say that the heat this time of the year is having some play on the pump and the hose since both of them are made of different types of plastic, so they are probably expanding differently. Don't be too aggressive in pumping. You could break the handle off on the pump. Keep in mind that in order to pump one gallon of water, you would have to push and pull the handle almost three feet four times in order to get that one gallon of water extracted. Here are some examples of how many pumps it would take to empty certain items. A 20 gallon fish tank would take 80 pumps. A 42 gallon standard bathtub would take 168 pumps. A 50 gallon or 55 gallon barrel would take anywhere from 200 to 210 pumps. And a 400 gallon hot tub would take 1600 pumps in order to 
empty it. If you want a really good workout, empty a hot tub. Please like, comment, or subscribe. Thanks again.